What are your thoughts about the team's continuing need to identify the uh, number one quarterback? I'm all for it. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, where do you, where do you think that might be going? You know, I, I'm not sure. I, I know that they'll probably have a lot of uh, evaluation in the offseason on the guys that are on the roster. And obviously, if we're the number one or number two pick, we're going to be in position to take a great college quarterback as well. Whether they go that way or not, it's tough to say, but I know that, uh, you know, since 99, the team's been looking for that franchise quarterback. And uh, no matter who you are in the NFL, that's always your number one job, whether you have one or you're looking for one. Um, so I'm not a QB evaluator, but I'm sure it's going to be the number one priority is figuring out if we have one on our roster or if we need to go get one. If you listen to you, it seems that uh, he's at least of the mind that RG3 still has a chance in his mind to be the guy. Uh, does he strike you as a guy who's a serious candidate, RG? I do. I think uh, we've got a limited amount of uh, film on him so far, but I think the things that we've seen in meeting rooms, on the practice field, <laughs> um, in some of the games, um, I think you've seen franchise level talent for sure. And uh, I wouldn't write him off by any stretch of the imagination. So. Um, I wouldn't be shocked at all if, if he was our guy at the beginning of next season because um, I think he has shown enough that if they do decide to make Robert the guy, I think he definitely can um, definitely be the guy, and I think he'd have the support of the locker room.